Hello everyone, I'm back. Happy New Year to everyone. Super, super glad to see you guys. Excited about this upload and recording. Um, just so you know, you know, we, we take a little bit of, of a break in the beginning of the year, kind of refocus, recalibrate, etc., etc., etc. But I could not wait to upload this recording and share some of my favorite body mist from Bath and Body Works. I think that's all we're doing is Bath and Body Works today for zero and below weather. So if you're interested to find out what fragrance mist I'm coming on to share today, please continue to watch. All right, so let's get into it. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are super, super glad to have you. If this is your very first time ever meeting your girl, I am Color Me Bad Lynn. At least that is what and who I go about over here on YouTube and Instagram a little bit. Welcome. We talk about everything, anything that has to do with beauty on the inside out, all things beauty. Hashtag all things beauty. We talk about love, relationships, romance. A little bit about dating, probably dating issues, uh, family issues, and faith, most importantly, and anything else that we forgot to mention, charge my head and out my heart. We will get into those topics as well. So, as you know, your girl loves to smell good, and I know you do too, and that's probably why you are or have clicked on this recording. So I want to tap in with you, check in with you, say hey, hey, and share some of my below zero and when i say below zero i mean below zero freeze out unthought and smell absolutely phenomenally amazing all right so if you're familiar with our channel and me you know that i love to play a little bit of music in the background i'm going to turn it down in just a minute and hopefully it'll be muted out on this recording i'm getting a lot better with that um, but if you can hear a little bit of it I am listening to the great Reverend Al Green. If you're not familiar with who he is, which you should be, but if you're not, it's okay. I'm going to share a couple pictures of his album covers for you at the very end like I normally do. So that if you didn't know, now you'll know. Let's get into it. Um, before I share with my first, you know, in the cold winter months, you know, we always have snacks. Things that we like to snack on when we're at home, okay? Okay. And one of my favorite things to snack on this winter would probably be, other than potato chips, y'all, I got it, you know, we got the, you know, it's a, it's, a, it's a situation, the chip bag, you know, the chip bag. But I have really, really been enjoying and almost close to and or addicted to almonds. If you can feel me on that, let your girl know down in the comments. All right, first scent that will smell absolutely amazing all year round, really. But I wore this, I think, like a day or so ago and layered it with one of my favorite fragrances. I think at bedtime, because a lot of times what I try to do, as I've shared before, is I try to wear fragrances at night um, so that I can kind of gain an opportunity to find out their longevity, whether or not they actually smell good on me what they do and don't smell good with. And lately I have really been into my bedtime fragrance combinations. I normally just spray on a little something here or there and don't make a huge big deal about it. But lately I've been coming up with some really nice layering combinations, you know, ready for Betty. So the first one I wanna share with you guys, and I gotta put this on the tip of my nose. This one is Gingham Fresh by Bath & Body Works. If you don't already have this one in your collection, this is what the packaging looks like. Um, let me share the notes that are in this. It's got juicy pear, sparkling clementine, and fresh daisies. Such an absolutely gorgeous scent, you guys. Really, really pretty. Um, really fresh. Um, if you love like the scent back in the day from Victoria's Secret, pear glace, or some people say pear glace. We used to say glace. I'm not for sure. Um, the actual correct pronunciation, but glossé sounds a whole lot more, you know, better, more better. That's what the kids say. Next one on the list is called Butterfly. Let me show you guys this one. And I know you probably have this one in your collection, but I didn't have this one up until recent. And I love this scent. This is so pretty, you guys. I mean, I've always liked the packaging. I'm not that much of a, a purple girl. That's not my favorite color, but... Lately, I've been gravitating towards this color. Um, and, you know, I found this in those little 
uh, clearance bins. And I thought, why not? Why not try it? That's how you always try things you've never had before. You don't know what they smell like. This one has raspberry nectar. It has iris petals. I love the note of iris in my fragrances. I love good florals. And then it also has airy vanilla, you guys. This is so pretty. I know you can probably wear this all year round, but I wore this um, the other night, and I can't remember what I paired this with. I think Michael Kors, something Michael Kors. I can't even remember, but this smells absolutely amazing. I can still smell the combination of the two when I woke up the next morning, and that's what I did it for, to play around with it. And I'm also going through fragrances, trying to see which ones I want to give away, which ones I want to keep. This is absolutely gorgeous. So if you don't have Butterfly by Bath & Body Works and you love a good sweet vanilla, sweet raspberry scent, this is gorgeous, you guys. And normally for me, I'll share that raspberry, sometimes some berries all together kind of give me a little bit of a tartness depending on what they're combined with. They did an amazing job, as always, with how they formulated those notes together absolutely gorgeous and i definitely want to get the body cream to that one the next time i re-up on lotions and body creams um at the time that i grabbed that i was just test running it i really didn't need anything you know for three bucks you know you're not hurting nobody and it's just a great opportunity to try new since you're not familiar with without breaking the bank all right next up on the list let's get her done let's do it let's do it do it do it I'm just gonna reach in the bag. I got two bags to dig out of, so I'm gonna make this one empty and then we'll move on to the next bag so you guys can hear my thoughts on these. This one is called Prismatic Stars, you guys. Another purple bottle. <laughs> oh my God. So I sprayed out on this and you know, like I said, let's see what's happening. Good, good 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 like you need a song you need a song about good 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 fragrance notes raspberry stardust anybody know mystic plum anybody know cosmic cashmere and then they got a little bit of a saying underneath the force it says new beginnings await under a dream filled sky i don't know about y'all but i'm down for that i'm down for it right now I like it. It smells absolutely amazing. Get you some. I had to turn I had to turn Al down a little bit so we don't get the copyrights. We get those sometimes, you know. All right. So next on the list, this is one of my favorites. I haven't sprayed out on this one just yet. Um, whenever they have the little annual sales or semi-annual sales, if I'm out of this particular spray or the body cream or the lotion and they have it available on sale i try to at least get two of these because the first time i got this set was when i think when it first came out i can't remember but i got the cream the shimmering cream the spray whatever comes with it and i held on to that since y'all it took me like three almost probably the beginning of this year i finished my shimmering body cream it smelled that good so I wouldn't even touch it because it smelled that good to me. This is fairy tale, you guys. One of my favorites. And you know I don't pick sides and favorites. Now, trust me when I tell you. Let me share some of the notes that are in this one. Just in case you're not familiar, this is something you may be interested in adding to your repertoire. And none, I don't think any of these scents are new. But the new ones that are out, I like too. We'll talk about those maybe in a couple weeks or so. But, all right, so pomegranate nectar fresh orange blossom vanilla bean and warm amber this is by far my one of my favorites if not my favorite scent from bath and body works it used to be hello beautiful and beautiful day those are my two faves but this right here y'all is absolutely gorgeous it smells good all year around, but if you wear this when it's really, 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 really cold outside and you take your wrap off, it's something magical that happens with this scent, you guys. It is so beautiful, beautiful below zero or close to zero uh, weather performer of a body mist. And I'm going to tell you something. All of the ones that I'm sharing with you today, 
you can actually wear these by themselves and you don't need a fragrance on they last and you can really smell them i just like to layer up uh, because they do a little bit for me but not like i like my fragrances to permeate and create a great scent bubble for me but for a lot of people that's really all you need for a scent get you some I don't know what they I don't know what this wire is doing right here. This right here. I don't know what this doing. But I'm somebody better explain what's going on with my equipment. <laughs> oh my god, I got questions. Okay, the next one that smells really, really good in this type of weather. These are all the ones that I've been playing around with, you guys, since the new year rung in. <clears throat> this one is called Into the Night. You probably already have this one in your collection as well. And I really want to give my, my, my kudos to Bath & Body Works, um, you know, whoever's in their laboratory kicking it because they know what they're doing. I'm normally not a raspberry person. Almost every scent that I've named, except for I think one, has raspberry in it, and they are so good. This one is Raspberry Noir. It has amber crystals, a velvety rose petals. You know, that's my favorite thing is rose. I love rose anything. Creamy patchouli. I love patchouli. It has mocha musk. Beautiful from beginning to end. Again, this is another one, you guys, um, that if you grab this one, get the shower gel and the body cream that goes with this and maybe even the perfume, the bomb. Do you hear me? Next one on the list that I've been enjoying, this one is almost empty, y'all. This one is called Dream Bright. So good. This one has sapphire berries, which is probably a raspberry. <laughs> um, it has night blooming orchid. I love orchids and crystallized vanilla. And I love what they put on the back of this one. It says a fragrance dream come true, sparkling with facets of bright fruits and nights blooming florals. Very, very gorgeous. Very, very sexy. Very, very sexy. This is not a work scent, y'all. It's super sexy. You hear me? Unless you're trying to catch. The next one I've been enjoying is Ballet Nights. Okay, bring the packaging in a little bit closer. This is so good, y'all. This one is Wild Plum Shocker. The second one that I've been loving that has plum in it. Normally, plum goes tart on me, depending on how it's formulated. This has been my friend, y'all. This one has wild plum, glowing amber. I'm an amber girl, so mostly everything you ever hear me talking about, especially in fragrances, have amber in them. Not all of them, but a lot. Um, and Tonka Cream. Like, they gave us Tonka, and then they're going to make it creamy. Play all day. I keep trying to fix my glasses, but they still crooked. You know, one side of our face is different from the other one, you guys. Okay, so... The next one I've been enjoying, you guys, of course, is Luminous. And I know this is one of the hotter fragrances right now from Bath & Body Works. I enjoyed this from beginning to end. It's almost empty, you guys. I got maybe about two more uses out of this one. This is such a beautiful scent. I didn't know anything about it. And I don't know if I've shared with you before that a lot of times I place my orders online for stuff like this. And then I have it sent to a local store nearby. And then I'll go grab them and pick them up. When you do that, um, you don't have to pay for shipping and handling. And I just like the fact of just going in and picking up my order and not having to go through the store and get myself in trouble. Unless you got rewards points. And I'm telling you, I've been racking up those rewards points, y'all. And I really enjoy them because that's how I get my candles. Tell you about that later. Anyways, this one has ruby current. I love any current. Black current, white current, red current. Love any current in a fragrance. Um, gilded iris I love iris and then praline amber this is so pretty y'all like this is so gorgeous this is definitely an after five um, it's really not a work scent but if you just have one of those days where you really really just want to smell extra special you may not be feeling your best or even if you are feeling your best and you want to feel better this is such a beautiful fragrance and this is just one of those pick me up I smell gorgeous I smell beautiful Smell me, darling. See, I'm on good behavior today, so I won't get in trouble. I don't think I'm going to get any copyrights today. I'm on good behavior. The next one that I really, really enjoy, you guys, and this is for special occasions for me. You know, because if you put too much glitter on, they're going to want to know where you've been the night before. You know, like, we don't need those assumptions. We got enough going on. 
People got enough to say anyway. We don't want to give them nothing extra. What you doing with some glitter on your face? You know, that type of thing. Don't play with us. Bath and Body Works, A Thousand Wishes, Diamond Shimmer Mist. I'm telling you right now, trust me when I tell you, um, the whole line is absolutely gorgeous, but this body shimmer is fabulous. It's like the body mist, the perfume, and the body cream mixed into one with some glitter in it, y'all. Pink Prosecco, you know what that means, Sparkling Keats, Crystal Peonies, Gilded Amber, there's that amber, and Amaretto Cream. Sound like a cocktail to me. Get you some. Oh, no, oh, no, she wasn't sitting at the bar waiting on somebody to pick, looking like something. she was waiting on somebody to pick her up. No, she wasn't. All right, next one. Strawberry Snowflakes. The Nerve. <laughs> oh, my God. Sitting there, lost in sauce. All right, fragrance notes. Juicy Strawberry whipped cream and iced bergamot i'm telling you right now you see what the bottle look like y'all and i haven't had this that long like it is divine like this right here smell good y'all know what i always say this smell good <laughs> holla so we're gonna make this the last scent before i get to talking for real because you know color me color me gonna say something she going to say something. I might not say nothing for a minute. But, you know, sometimes you just, you know, you just start to talking and then, you know, you just keep on talking. And it's like, that's the reason why. Now, I'm just going to say this. That's the reason why people should mind their own business. Like, at, like if we just focus on ourselves and improving on us and making sure that we are together and making sure that we are doing everything that we can possibly be to be the best human being we could possibly be, we would not have time to worry about what someone else is doing. Henceforth, why are you sitting at a bar looking like you waiting on somebody to pick you up? You too old for that. All right, the next one. And this is the very last one. <laughs> why? Okay, I just want, you know, they say don't why ask why or why not? If you don't ask, you won't know, right? So I'm waiting on an answer for that one because I'm trying to figure that out. And and when you figure out why you were sitting at a bar waiting on, looking like looking like somebody was you were waiting on somebody to pick you up, then that, that should take you long enough to mind your business for the rest of this year. All right, twisted peppermint. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. All right, so the next one. Cool peppermint smells so good. So, okay, so I'm going to share. This is a special testimony. Testimony service is now open. This is absolute, and I'm not giving honor to nobody right now, nobody but God. But let me tell you something. This smells so good, you guys. And I didn't think I was going to like this. But, I, you know, I'm at that age now where, you know, the beautiful age of maturity where, uh, you know, things start to change internally. Therefore, they change externally as well. And so we have to fight those things as much as possible. Right. And you, sometimes we get a little warm, if you know what I mean. OK, like really like out of nowhere, you just get a little warm. This is a perfect fragrance. For any woman of a mature age that loves a sweet kind of candied scent to layer with a fragrance that they're wearing or just to wear at bedtime, this was such a unique and smart idea um, as this was being created. They managed to put a sweet, creamy, soft peppermint inside of a spray bottle for a fragrance and it actually cools you down this is so beautiful y'all and i kid you not if you get some or even if you're just walking through one of the stores one day and you decide to kind of spray yourself a little bit just to test it out and see if i'm telling the truth or not you know you got to test folks out nowadays you got a whole lot of people on the, on the internet talking to giving you relationship advice and they're not even in relationships you know i keep talking about that because it's becoming an epidemic and quit listening to these men telling y'all, don't talk to the man, leave the man, stop doing that. All right. 
cool peppermint sugared snow fresh balsam vanilla buttercream perfection this is absolutely gorgeous if you don't have this in your fragrance library i highly recommend that you add this get the lotion the body cream the shower gel and again for women of a more mature age and you don't even have to be 40 plus years old you could be younger than that and be going through some changes hormonally after children during pregnancy things of that nature this is a perfect perfect fragrance scent for anybody who has flashes if you know what i'm talking about that's all i wanted to come on and share today i really appreciate you guys tuning in with me enjoying the videos and recordings i know it's been a while since i popped on and uploaded a fragrance video but it is just because we need time as human beings to reflect to meditate to fast and pray to consecrate ourselves and things of that nature reset recalibrate get in touch with the universe you know there are so many different terminologies of what we need to do to get ourselves grounded go stand out outside barefoot you know they call it grounding we used to do that when we were kids go whack a tree with a with a with a brick or something i don't know whatever it is it, it takes for you to kind of reset detox get yourself together and kickstart your new year with a bang happy new year to everybody even though we're way past the new year it's still january so uh, thank you so much for all of your love and your support. I want to welcome all of my new subscribers, even the ones that have gone on. If you decide to come back, welcome back. This is your girl, Color Me Bad Linson. Thank you guys for watching. I greatly appreciate all of your love and your support. I am super excited to come on and share my sexiest fragrance combinations for the first of the year, you guys. I have found some gorgeous combinations in my collections, fragrances I forgot I had. Getting ready to give them away and like, hold it on, see, adios, deuces.